Hey, my name is Joe and this is my Crafts Master Dice Shooting Journey. I got a message from a friend of mine asking about how I'm coming up with the 90 different results for the dice rolls when I'm doing this, this series here. Um, because in reality, there's only 36 different combinations that you can come up with. And um, when I rolled the dice out to see what how all 36 combinations came out, I found, and at least that's me, I found that there's 90 different results that I could come up with. So let's kind of go through them. Um, I started with the hardware set. This is the one that I used in the beginning. And by the way, I changed the results. If you look at the first comment in that video, um, I have the actual results, the results that I that should have been. Um, but starting with the... And by the way, this video is going to be an unedited video, so I'm just really, I'm shooting it really quick. I'm going to put it out really quick, so that way they are what they are. Um, but if you look at the hard way set here, 5454, four, four, you have your primary number. So you have the fives on tops. So that's one, two, three, and four. And then we get back to our beginning there. So that's four results there. Um, and then we have a double pitch, so you can go five, four. On the left dice, and we double pitch the right dice, so that's five, two, so that's five, six, seven, and eight for our results. And then going back to our original dice set again, um, we can do the single pitch, and I found that you can single pitch one way or you can single pitch the other way. So if I single pitch the first way, we have the five, four, the four, two, two, three, and the three, five. And then if I single pitch the other way, we have a five, three, four, five, two, four, and three, two. Okay, so that would be um, all of them based off of the first dice set here, or the first way that it's rolled out. So that would be a total of 16 different results. Now I go through and the next one that I found was if I import one dice, so it's import the right dice right now. And I go all the way around, it's a five, one, four, four, two, six, three, three. So that's another four combinations there. And I can import the right dice again and I'll double pitch the other one and that'll go through all four of them. So we have a two, one, Three, four, five, six, and four, three. And then if I import that right dice again, I can single pitch the left one. So the four, one, two, four, three, six, five, three. And we'll go back in again to the original set. Importing that right dice for the last single pitch. So we have a 3 1, 5 4, 4 6, and 2 3. So that's all the imports on the right side of the dice. Going back to our original dice set again. Um, now we can import the left dice. Because remember when we do the 36 combinations, the um, 2 and 12 will only roll one way because you can only roll it one way. But if you go with the 4 and the 10, I'm sorry, 4 and 11, you know, the 4 can roll with a 1, 3 or a 3, 1 and a 2, 2. So that's three different combinations right there. So that's kind of how the reasoning or the logic didn't come up with that. Um, so again, we're going to import that left dice. And we got the four different ways this way here. We got 6, 5, 4, 4. One, two, and three, three. Okay. If we import the right or left dice again, we can double pitch the right one. So we have a six, two, four, three, one, five, three, four. Okay. And again, we're importing that left dice. We're going to single pitch the the right one here. And um, we have a six, four, a four, two, a three, four, I'm sorry, one, three, four, and we have a three, five. 
And if we import that left dice again, we single pitch the opposite way. We have a 6-3, a 4-5, a 1-4, and a 3-2. Okay, and then what we could do is that was all the implodes for this to this point. Now, now we can explode the dice now. So if I explode the right one, we got the four numbers. We got four six, four four, one two one, three three. Okay, and then I can explode the right dice, and I can double pitch the other one. So we have a two six, three four. 5, 1, and a 4, 3. Okay, and then we go back to our original dice set here. <clears throat> and um, we can explode that right dice again. And then we can single pitch our dice again. So we have a 4, 6, 2, 4, 3, 1, and a 5, 3. Okay, and if we explode that right dice again and we single pitch the other way, we have a 3 6, 5 4, 4 1, and a 2 3. Okay, and then going back to our dice set here again, our original dice set are 5 4 5 4, and we can explode that left dice now. So if we explode the left dice, we have the um, 1 5. 4, 4, 6, 2, and 3, 3. And if we um, explode the left dice here and we double pitch it, we have a 1, 2, 4, 3, 6, 5, 3, 4. And then our last set of combinations are going to be single pitching. So if we explode that left dice and we single pitch the right dice, we have a 1, 4, 4, 2, 6, 5, and 3, 5. Going back to our original dice set here again. And then if we um, explode that left dice and we single pitch the opposite direction, we're going to have the 1, 3, 4, 5, 6, 4, 3, 2. Okay, so that's all those. And then what we could do is we can, um, we could do double implodes. Um, so let's say double implodes. That's where your 6-1 is going to come up, your 4-4, four, four, your 1-6, and your 3-3. Three, three. And then we do a, neck, a double explode. So I have um, the 4-6, four, 6-4, six, six, four, 3 one, and the 1-3. So that's how I came up with the 90 different possible um, results. So my question is, guys, because... When you come up with those results, you're going to have the same dice set show um, several different ways, but that's the 90 different ways of the dice. And like I said, my question is, is that the right way of doing it? Um, you're going to have, you know, several sixes show at the same time, several sevens show, show at the same time, the same time, and it's the same dice result, but it's a different way to roll into it. So is that right, guys? Um, or am I oversimplifying this thing or even making it too complicated? Hey, leave a comment below. Uh, let me know what your th thought is. My goal, again, is to make this as transparent as I possibly can. Um, this is a learning experience for me just as much as I hope it is for you guys. Hey, my name is Joe, and this is my Crafts Master Dice Shooting Journey. Please leave a comment, like, sub, and subscribe.